No one uh, old enough will ever doubt Lionel Rose's ability in the ring. In the late 60s, Lionel was boxing's golden boy. But he was also a pioneer for Indigenous Australians in this country, as well as a tireless campaigner against racism everywhere. In a sport often tarnished by crooks and con men, Lionel Rose was not perfect, but still a good guy who sadly last night ran out of fight. Here's Leanne West. Put some pressure on the challenger in this 13th round, a beautiful right, and get a lot, he's down, a perfect right hand. He can do things other fighters could never do. Combination, the rhythm, speed, balance, timing. He had everything. Lionel Rose also had the power to unite. His greatest moment in the ring, the 1968 world title victory in Tokyo against Japan's fighting Harada. It came just a year after Australians voted at a referendum to include Aboriginal people in the census. I give fighting for a flag for all people who live in Australia. Black, white, brindle, no matter what colour there was. He flew, he flew the flag for Australia. When he got home, thousands of people were waiting for him at Melbourne Airport. The 19-year-old from Warrigal and country Victoria didn't know why. Uh, when he arrived back in Australia and there were thousands of people there, he was looking around to see if Elvis was on the plane because he couldn't understand uh, uh, that you know everybody was there to see him. He was a very, very humble man. As it turned out, it was Elvis who wanted to meet him. But while Rose's deeds became world famous, his heart always lay elsewhere. When he was massive overseas, like he didn't want to be overseas. He just wanted to go to his hometown in, in Warrigal and, and be himself. Lionel Rose wasn't just a national sporting hero, he was Australia's first Aboriginal sporting hero. And his recognition paved the way for Indigenous athletes of the future. He can show that other people, that he can do it. Aboriginal people can do it, and he done it. On the walls of Tony Mundine's gym, some of the athletes that followed the trail blazed by Lionel Rose. He was the best. I mean, for me, he's the greatest Australian fighter ever. That's including my dad, including you know, all the greats that Australia has produced. He was the, the pioneer. He was the first. The first Aboriginal uh, world boxing champion. The first Aboriginal Australian, Australian of the else. year. And later, a top-selling country singer. But when I found that girl, that thought of only me. How will you remember him? Great mate. Great father. And uh, we said he's gone. Let me thank you for just being. pioneer and uh, I guess you don't have to be a fan of boxing to like boxers.